consider this example in this language is given to us as a raised to the power i square such that i should be greater than or equal to 1 if you analyze this language you will see that it will contain strings like these if i is equals to 1 it will be a raised to the power 1 square that is a only if i is equals to 2 it will be a raised to the power 2 square that is a raised to the power 4 if i is equals to 3 it will be a raised to the power 3 square that is a raised to the power 9 if i is equals to 4 it will be a raised to the power 4 square that is a raised to the power 16 and so on the strings will continue so using the pumping lemma we have to prove this language to be not regular if it is so for that the first step is we will assume that the language is regular let l is a regular language then if it is a regular language it will have a pumping length p such that we will assume that some value for p we have assumed the value for pumping length to be 4 this time now if l is regular and it has a pumping length then all the strings in that language should have length greater than equal to pumping length that can be pumped that means all the strings in this language this language is this one all the strings that have length greater than equal to p that means greater than equal to 4 that means this string has length 1 so discard this all the strings that have length greater than or equal to 4 can be pumped so that means a4 a9 a16 and so on can be pumped because they have length greater than or equal to 4 so if all those strings can be pumped then let us consider one string out of that set let us say we have assumed some string to be a raised to the power 4 this string we have taken so according to our third step this can be pumped because it has the length equal to 4 greater than equal to 4 strings can be pumped easily so this string is basically a a a a 4 a's so fifth step is now we will pump the string in pumping the string the step follows with division of the string first we will divide the string into x y and z three parts so consider a a a a if i consider this first a as x these two a's as y and this last a as z so this is x y i z is equals to this much when i is equals to one here if i increase the value of i to be two that means x y square z this will become x will contain a as it is y square will contain 4 a's because 1 y contains 2 a's so y square will contain 4 1 2 3 4 and a of z will be as it is so if you count this 1 2 3 4 5 6 it is a raised to the power 6 so we have pumped the string now now the question is sixth point the sixth point says that if these three conditions never satisfy at the same time that then we will conclude that our assumption is wrong so let's check for the three conditions first the first condition is x y i z should belong to l our x y i z is x y square z that we have pumped so x y square z is a raised to the power 6 now if you see it carefully there is no way that you can equate this a raised to the power 6 as a raised to the power i square why because a base is okay but 6 can never be equated to i square why it cannot be equated because you cannot find one single valued integer that on squaring will give you 6 so that means a raised to the power 6 cannot be equated to a raised to the power i square that is our language that means this a raised to the power 6 does not belong to our language L that means x y square z does not belong to L so the first condition is not true in this case the second condition is length of x y should be less than equal to p the length of x y is x is 1 and y is 2 1 plus 2 it is 3 3 is less than equal to 4 p so second condition is satisfied Fourth is the length of y should be greater than 0. Y we have chosen as the length of 2. So 2 is greater than 0. So third condition is satisfied. So as per our sixth point, 
the three conditions are not satisfied at the same time. So, we say that our assumption is wrong. It is a contradiction to our assumption. Now, why it is contradiction? Listen it very carefully. We have said in third point that all the strings in our language L that have length greater than or equal to pumping length can be pumped. So, we choose a string that satisfies this third point because it has length equal to 4. So, as per third point, it can be pumped. But on pumping, we saw that we get a raised to the power 6. Now, this a raised to the power 6 does not belong to our language. First, we were saying that all the strings can be pumped that have length greater than or equal to 4. But on pumping, we saw that after pumping that string, that string is never a part of this language now. Then how can we say that it can be pumped? So, this is a contradiction to our third point. On pumping it, we saw that it cannot be pumped because on pumping, it does not be a, is not be a part of this language L. So, this point is contradicting our third point and if this third point is contradicted then obviously second point is also contradicted that it has a pumping length if second is contradicted then first is contradicted that l is a regular language so by pumping lemma through our sixth procedure point we say that l is not regular i hope it is clear to you why the language l is not regular only thing we have to get is we have to choose a string that have length greater than or equal to pumping length we have to pump that string if on pumping it not satisfy the three conditions we say that we have got the contradiction to our assumption and i have told you how the contradiction works so l is not regular in this case now let us consider one more example 